Welcome to Indie Evo and Indie Fuel. Let's show you how to use your new earbuds. Indie Evo and Indie Fuel have the same controls. The one difference is that Indie Fuel comes with a case that can be charged wirelessly. So keep in mind that the following steps will work for you whether you have Indie Evo or Indie Fuel. If you're looking for a specific feature, you can skip ahead in this video using these time codes. Your earbuds will automatically turn on when you remove them from the case. And they'll automatically turn off when you put them back in the case. To turn off your buds outside of the case, touch each bud for six seconds. To turn them back on, touch each bud for four seconds. To pair to your device for the first time, place the buds in the charging case without closing the case. Make sure both LEDs show red and then remove them. Both buds will then automatically power on and the LEDs will simultaneously flash blue while they sync to each other. Once the buds have synced together, you'll hear a tone to indicate the sync was successful and only the left bud will begin to flash red-blue. Now. Turn on your device's Bluetooth and, depending on which Indie earbuds you have, look for Indie Evo or Indie Fuel in your list of available Bluetooth devices. Select Indie Evo or Indie Fuel on your device and accept any pair or OK prompts that appear on your screen. When pairing is complete, a voice prompt will say, Connected. To pair to a new device, remove your buds from the case to power them on. Then, touch either bud for four seconds to enter pairing mode. Select Indie Evo or Indie Fuel on your device and accept any pair or OK prompts that appear on your screen. When pairing is complete, a voice prompt will say, Connected. Indie Evo and Fuel fit comfortably and securely in your ear thanks to Stability Ear Gels. Here's how to get the best fit. First, place the bud in your ear at an angle. Then, twist it forward to get the stability gel securely in place. The stability gel will feel comfortable and stable when properly placed. Indy comes with two sizes of stability gels to help you find the best fit. Try each size of the stability gels to see which fit works best for you. Indie Evo and Fuel have a full suite of controls on each earbud to keep you connected without having to touch your phone. To play or pause your music, tap either bud twice. To turn up the volume, tap the right bud once. To turn down the volume, tap the left bud once. To skip a song forward, touch the right bud for two seconds. To skip a song backward, touch the left bud for two seconds. To take a call, tap either bud twice. You can also end the call by tapping either bud twice. To reject a call, touch either bud for two seconds. To activate your device's assistant, tap either bud three times. To charge your earbuds, place them in the charging case. The earbud LEDs will be solid red while charging. The LEDs will turn off when fully charged. 10 minutes of charging will provide two plus hours of playtime. When your battery has less than 30 minutes of playtime left, a voice prompt will notify you, battery low, and the LEDs will flash red every five seconds. If you're using your earbuds with an Apple device, you can check their battery life on the shortcut screen when they're connected to your device. Indie Evo and Indie Fuel's case can be independently charged with or without the buds in it. To check how much battery life is left, open the case and the LEDs on the front of the case will turn on. Each LED that is on equals 25% of battery life. While charging, the LEDs will go from blinking to solid to represent each 25% of charged capacity from 25% up to 100%. To charge your case, Plug in the USB-C rapid charge cable and connect to a computer, wall charger, power bank, or 12-volt adapter in a car. A 10-minute charge of the charging case will provide two plus hours of battery playtime. 
to charge your Indy Fuel case wirelessly. Simply lay your charging case on a wireless charging pad and make sure the lightning bolt on the back of the case is face down and centered on the charging pad. Sometimes, you want to be able to hear your music, but still hear what's going on around you. When you want to do that, you can use just one earbud. We call this solo mode. Both the left and right earbud of Indie Evo and Fuel can be used in solo mode. To use solo mode, make sure both earbuds are on and connected. Then, place the earbud you aren't using back in the case. The remaining bud will stay paired and function with both phone calls and music. To use both earbuds again, simply remove the other bud from the case at any time and you will hear a tone, or the music will seamlessly begin to stream to indicate that you have automatically entered back into stereo mode. Indie Evo and Fuel also feature ambient mode. Ambient mode is especially useful when you want to hear more of your surroundings and keep both earbuds in. Like solo mode, Ambient mode is great for busy environments or for working out because it increases your awareness of what's around you. But unlike solo mode, ambient mode lets you hear your surroundings without having to remove an earbud. To activate ambient mode, tap either bud once and then quickly touch the same bud for two seconds. To turn off ambient mode, repeat the same steps. To help you get the best sound quality from your content, Indie Evo and Fuel also feature our new EQ listening modes. The three modes are Music Mode, Podcast Mode, and Movie Mode. To alternate EQ modes, tap either bud twice, then quickly touch the same button for two seconds. A voice prompt will notify you each time your EQ mode changes. Your default EQ setting is Music Mode, which is great for general listening. Podcast mode removes most of the bass response and is great for podcasts or audiobooks. Movie mode slightly increases the loudness and bass to enhance your favorite action-packed media. To make sure you never lose your earbuds, we've built Tile technology into Indie Evo and Indie Fuel. The Tile tracking feature is really easy to set up and will allow you to locate either one of your earbuds if you've misplaced them or if they're ever taken. When searching for missing earbuds, you can also use the Tile app to sound a tone from your buds to help you locate them. You can sound a tone from one earbud or both. First, you'll need to download the Tile app for this feature to function with your device. Once you've downloaded the Tile app, follow the on-screen instructions to connect each earbud individually so they are both trackable. Indie Evo and Fuel are also compatible with the Skullcandy app. You can use our app to assist in pairing, alternate between EQ modes, activate ambient mode, and access user guides and troubleshooting help. Here's how you reset Indie Evo and Fuel to resolve pairing difficulties. First, remove your earbuds from your device's Bluetooth paired list. Now, Turn off both earbuds by touching each bud for six seconds. Then, touch each bud for 10 seconds to completely reset them. You'll see the LEDs flash blue first, and then finally, red. Now, place each bud back in the case until both LEDs show red, and then remove them. Both buds will automatically power on, and the LEDs will simultaneously flash blue while they sync to each other. At this time, Turn on your device's Bluetooth and look for Indie Evo or Indie Fuel in your list of available Bluetooth devices. Select Indie Evo or Indie Fuel on your device and accept any pair or OK prompts that appear on your screen. When pairing is complete, a voice prompt will say, Connected.